Hey everyone, Reptile Sam here. So today I'm going to show you something something that's pretty difficult to, to do. I'm going to show you how to determine the biological sex of your snake through probing. And this is the best way to sex an adult snake, but it should only be done if you're very careful and you know exactly what you're doing. So feel free to like watch this video several times if you need to know the sex of your snake. Otherwise, I don't recommend sexing the snake just because you want to, because it can harm the animal. So you really need to know what you're doing. Um, but this is the best, safest, and most effective way to determine the biological sex of your adult snakes. So I'll be showing you guys Sprout today, who is an adult female corn snake, and Herman, who is about one year old, and he's a male boa constrictor. So I'll show you what the difference looks like in those two animals and in the two sexes. So I hope you guys uh, enjoy this and um, learn a lot from this video. So the only things you need for this are a paper towel to put your petroleum jelly or water-based lubricant on that you can buy pretty much at any grocery store to help out with the process because it'll be easier on your snakes. A set of snake probes, so you see those three different sizes here. I'm going to use the medium one for Sprout and the larger one for Herman. And something to clean your probes with in between each snake because you don't want the risk of spreading disease or any other kind of bacteria in between animals. So I have the lubricant that we'll use for the snake on this paper towel. Right now I'm just getting the probe wet so it won't hurt the snake when it goes in. So this is the snake's vent and this is where you will sex the snake. You want your snake to be pretty relaxed and you'll just kind of press until you can feel a little bit of pressure right here in the vent. And it can be a little bit tough to get it in, but your snake will be fine. And it'll just slide in, don't force it anywhere. Just let it slide as far as it'll go naturally. And that shows that Sprout is in fact a female because it only went in several scales deep. If, if Sprout were a male, it would have gone about nine to 10 scales deep. But with female snakes, it only goes in about four or five scales deep. So on Herman, you also go to the vent right here where my thumb is. And with a male snake, this will go into the hemipene. And that would, would be in the same spot, but it'll go in much deeper without if, if exert any force at all. Just wanna let it slide in and then take it out. You see how far that one went in? That shows you that, that Herman is in fact a male snake because of how deep the probe went in. So on a female, it'll stop really short, only about right here, a few scales in, because there's no hemipene for it to go into. But on a male snake, it'll slide into the hemipene, and you'll get to see that your snake is in fact a male. So I'd like to thank my two volunteers today, Herman and Sprout, for their willingness to let me uh, figure out what their biological sex is today. And yeah, so if you guys have any questions, let me know, reach out to me. Uh, I'd be happy to help explain the process. Um, again, there's no reason to do this if your breeder sells you your snakes as a male or female and you doesn't really matter to you like if, if you just have like one pet corn snake you don't really need to do this process but if you're trying to breed it's important to be 100 percent sure that your snakes are what they say they are or if you have like a bow constrictor where the male is going to be about maybe five or six feet as opposed to a female that's eight to ten feet you definitely want to know whether or not you have a male or female so you know, just watch this video, um, watch other videos about how to determine your snake's sex and be very careful with the process because it can hurt them if it's done incorrectly. So if you have any questions, just reach out, let me know. I'd be happy to try to help you guys figure that out. So until next time, I'm Reptile Sam. This is my buddy Herman, and we'll see you guys later. Remember to like and subscribe.